Oh man, the problem, the problem with leading in with Scunny Cart is now I want to listen to Scunny Cart instead of listening to the game's music. That's what you're listening to, by the way. It's a terrible, terrible DOS um, racing game. It's a clone of Wacky Wheels, which is a clone of Mario Kart. And uh, let me see if I can find you this. Just so you know what you're looking at. Woo! Hi, Parker. This is what Scunny Kart's title screen looks like, so... You can already see the quality. Yeah, it's, it's great. I think that's Conquer. It actually, it actually looks a lot like Conquer, but I have to, I have to turn off. <laughs> the sad thing is that I have to turn off this song. That's unfortunate. Anyway, hi Parker. What do you have to say, honey? Is that so? I opened the forbidden door. He's mad at me. You have Clump? I take it from you. I don't know how he gets his main clumps. Like the clumps in his mane. But sometimes there's just one there and you just pull it off. Hi, Parker. Yes. Adventures in owning a long haired cat. Anyway. Why do I have. Did I save this when. Hi, Parker. Um, I think I saved that when we last did a stream. But I think I remember when we left off in the story. Honey! Please, I'm doing stuff. Yes. Turn this up a little bit on my end. Is that quiet for y'all? It looks quiet. Or is my thing just being weird? Meow. Yeah, it's quiet. Okay. We'll look at that. Par Parskins, please. I'm doing stuff. Um, we'll go back. <laughs> <laughs> I love Katsuragi sneaking around here. That's what she does. Oh, <laughs> you don't, you can't see. There we go. Mew! Yes, that's right, Parker. That's right, boys. Mondo cool! All right. Nothing sounds like bass boosted, does it? Like shitty YouTube air horn video y? I freaking uploaded the LSD video. And it was all ruined, and I, I have never had to do that before. I don't know... I don't know what happened there. Oh, sorry. That's their logo. Alright. <laughs> yes, that's a, that's a high quality gift. That's from the anime, which I've never watched. Do I own that anime? I, I don't think I do. I own one of the manga and then never read it, but I don't think I've watched the anime at all either. Or own it. I got the... <laughs> I got the Neptunia anime here, it's pretty bad. There's a new one, though. That's supposed to be kind of all right. Woo! The animation looks a lot better, anyway. Hi, Parker, yes! You are a noise boy. You are a noisy son, yes. Yes. Yes, yes. Can you hear him? Say hi. Say hi. When I want him to talk for the mic, he shuts up. He knows, he understands. All right, I think we played this one, but we're just gonna start just to be sure. So when, when we last left our heroes, Hibari had randomly shown up on our doorstep for reasons. Also, I went back, I went back and analyzed the footage. I went, I, I looked, I analyzed the footage and um, I was right. This is non-canon as far as I can tell. This, this does not mesh with the Hanzo story. There are, significant discrepancies that make it impossible for this to genuinely be the other side of the same thing. Like, this is... <laughs> this is, like, embellished towards their side, for sure, so... Which, I mean, they are evil shinobi, so I, I guess I'm not surprised, but... Yeah, I... <laughs> which is kind of weird, and making a remake, I think, would be a great opportunity to kind of merge the timelines and, like, sew together the weird bits that didn't really make sense and like split up and stuff, but I guess they, I guess they didn't do that. I guess we still have to wait for Senator Kagura 7 to see what the whole deal is with that. Hi, Parker. Yes, just put your claws right into my flesh. Thanks, that's great. <laughs> this, this drama. This There has never been a reason for the drama of this area on the Hejibo side. 
Can you hear them? Should I turn this up a bit? Yeah, this is really quiet. Parker. Parker. Get your tail out of my face, please. Thanks. Nah, we watched this. We watched this, didn't we? <laughs> you get the point. Hibari came over here and was like, hey, I want to join your club. I want to join your cool kids club. And then for some reason we believe her. But I mean, we don't really believe her because we're evil, but we have to believe her because we're evil. Evil Shinobi are stupid, is the point I'm making. And I mean stupid compared to the lady here who fights with her butt. I mean, it works pretty well for Peach, but... Okay, I'll make where I'm at. Okay. 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 And apparently they... What? Um... Apparently Warframe is doing its own Peach Beat Splash event. They're doing some kind of, like, thing where Tenno, like, fight with, like, um... I missed. Um... They fight with, like, water guns against their enemies, and, like, you play around in inner tubes and shit. And I mean, they're, like, weird robot people, so they're not really in swimsuits, but they got inner tubes, so you can pretend, I guess. We really need to hit that Parker goal on Patreon. Maybe I'll combine my Twitch subs goal along with it. Well, I don't have a Twitch subs goal, but my amount of Twitch subs to it. I keep losing. Focus. Okay, at some point, we'll get a we'll get a webcam and record Parker as he ruins my entire life. Oh, I finally ate good sushi this week. You know that? I, I had some sushi. It was from like Whole Foods or something. Um, in California, and I was like, oh. So it's rice, and rice, and that's basically all it is, and it was, it was lame, um, but we had, um, I forget exactly what I got, but it was tempura, it was avocado, and it was spicy crunchy tuna or something? It was, it's called the fire dragon at this uh, place that we got here. It's one of the super stuffed, it was like the special, they, there's the normal rolls they have, and then there's like the Seth special ones, which are pretty expensive, it was, it was like 12 bucks for a roll, but um, it was like jam-packed with stuff, they're like twice as wide as a regular sushi roll, and the tempura was really good, I really like tempura, so it was good to have some of that in there. I think the, the sushi I had before was just too plain, and it was just like, bleh. Hey, Pariah. This is way too nice. This... I actually don't like the Hejibo story as much. Um, I don't... Um, I don't like this game when it gets too edgelordy and gets like t too dramatic and like weird. Like the um, the introduction of Senkagura 2, I think, gets too edgy and grim, dark and weird, and it <laughs> it doesn't make a lot of sense. But I guess it's because the whole timeline divergence crap. <laughs> you gotta love that. This game, <laughs> this game is basically Zelda. There's though, there's only two. I think two timelines, not three like Zelda, but um, yeah, d two, two is really weird because it basically starts out completely reversing all character growth of the evil shinobi and just they're bad guys again and they're even edgier than normal and there's like demons and stuff coming out and it's weird and I don't know, but I usually like this game when it's more chill, but I think the um, I think the Hanzo side of this it really shows that that was kind of the original or like first way they wrote it. It, it makes a lot more sense, and I think it does the drama a lot better. And this one just kind of 
is like inappropriately happy. I usually like in, I usually like almost inappropriately happy. Like I really like Peach Beat Splash. Because they don't try to be too nuts, but they do have there's some like deeper plot lines and stuff. I hate that FOV effect. Or not FOV. The um depth of field. D O F. Yes. Close enough. There's no reason for it to be blurry. It's just the camera zooming in. Anyway, hopefully our hopefully my internet persists and is all right. I was when I got home, I was going to stream um, Pokémon Masters and then it my internet was bad. It was like 1 megabit up. And then I started drinking and then it got better again. And now I'm like, well, I don't want to stream Pokémon Masters while I'm smashed, so I'll play some Titty Ninjas. Oh, this is Yomi. You can always tell, whenever this background is happening, it's Yomi and she's talking about, you know, murdering rich people and things. Not necessarily the worst thing. <laughs> Unemployment Street. Subtle. Very, very, very subtle. Rotten bananas. Oh. Y Yomi. Yomi has some brain problems. Guess I've got brain problems! Do I have that in my stream kit? I should. I should if I don't. I don't even have my stream kit open right now. What a naughty boy. Do I have brain problems in here? I don't. I do have this, though. That's brain problems. I also have- I still have my Chaos Wars images! We need to get back to Chaos Wars. Chaos Wars was a fucking... experience. And a fucking aesthetic as well. Look at this young man. <laughs> that, no, that's what I'm talking about. I miss the whole- the whole gang is here! Someday. We'll get back. We'll get back to good old Chaos Wars. Can I put this on auto? Yes, I can. Okay. The gang's all here. <laughs> Beverly Hills. Mansions made from sheet metal. <laughs> this reads like a PJ's. Like something from the PJ's. It smells like the Vita. The Dulce Vita. The smell of packages. I wish every game had this auto advance so I didn't accidentally skip things, because I'm very impatient with the X button. Essential buttons. <laughs> Do these descriptive labels really necessary? Hmm. The background's kind of nice though, the, the, the contrast is rather evident here. What is your favorite burb, chat? Minus space. Oh, probably... <laughs> probably something lame and obvious like eagles or toucans, personally. I use my toucan in a lot in uh, Pokemon Sun and Moon. Creepy voice. You want some money, little miss? Come on with me! I'll show you how to be the real MLG! Always trust weird old men that lie to you about how to get lots of money. All those self-help books, totally real. What the hell is this? Oh, I know what this is. This is... <laughs> Beat up creepy old men is the moral of the story, honestly. Beat up... Beat up all boomers. Oh, do I... I have an image for that, don't I? Where do I have that? I've got this. This is relevant. But that's not what I wanted to show you. Um, I feel like I'm brainwashing you, chat. I don't mean to do that. I do, but I don't. 
Here we go. This is what we need. Oops, what is this? Not this. This is what we need. I don't know if this originally said shut the fuck up boomer or not. I don't know the original context of this image, but I don't need to know. If this is not the original context, I don't need the original context. Because this is perfect. <laughs> this is the perfect image. You may not like it, but this is what peak performance looks like. It does look like it was, like, the, the lettering does look like it was done in that style. Like, it does look like it's the original wording. Usually people who edit meme images are like me, and they just put it in, like, GIMP, and, like, it's, like, Arial font. Anyway, we don't, we don't need most of this on screen, do we? Can you get your story with the titty ninjas? What a great story. Old man comes out, is immediately beaten. Left for dead. <laughs> Curtains goes down, that's the end. Thank you for sticking around. Be beat up old people. Let me guess, she has no idea who that familiar person is. Even though we know exactly who that voice belongs to. For a street performer, BC Mask is quite fast! She's definitely not a ninja or anything. She's definitely not a ninja I've met like three times by now. <laughs> She's fast as a shinobi student! This is one of those anime things where... If you wear like a set of like... Like, frameless glasses, or lensless gla- whatever. Frameless and len lensless glasses, nobody can tell who you are. It's a perfect disguise. Genius. Oh, I have this. I don't know why I have this. I'm just looking through my images folder. It's a good folder. As you can see. It's a very good folder. Oh, it's a good folder. Very good folder. <clears throat> I think this is a real background you can use on Facebook, isn't it? The laughing, crying emoji. Like, sphere world. This is what hell looks like, my friends. I mean, we don't... <laughs> we don't need this. I've... I haven't used Facebook on purpose in, like, years. There's a Facebook where everyone has to try to, like, roleplay, like, boomers using Facebook. I think that's that's exactly where I got that image from, in fact. Um, I think. And it's pretty good. BC Mask is really... Oh, here we go. Princess. Boomer posting is praxis. This is an actual image of me with that sweet drank. <laughs> I love pictures of Parker where his head is inside of a thing and he's just going to town. That's, that's my favorite genre of Parker fiction. Especially in this one where his butt is like in the air and like a weird. Like. <laughs> he is in the weirdest stance right here. Wait, is there two chats? Uh, hold on. I have two chats? What's what's the deal here? Oh, I have two ch Why did I have two chats? Where's the other chat? Oh, there it is. How long has that been there? Oh, well. That's what I get for boomer posting. Mortifying. This is more- <laughs> it's, it's- How could you have possibly known?
It's a little small. As long as the chat is readable, that's fine. I don't want to waste too much space either. <laughs> Yomi is such a bitch. I, I can't stand her like this. She gets better, but like... Complete and utter bitch. Oh yes, binch. I want. What, what do binches taste like? It looks like a fancy Ritz cracker. What is it? I can't tell if that's supposed to be chocolate on the underside or if that's just the other side of the wrapper. What, by the way, it's like a Greek yogurt, like... I don't even know. One of those weird Betty Crocker things I never cared for. There's a Betty Crocker thing that's like that. I only liked Nutter Butters and, um... Those fake cupcakes that are like chocolate with... Cream stuff in the middle. Those are the only ones I really liked. Occasionally a Twinkie, but I got out of those pretty fast. Shortbread, something like that. Where's Farmer here to take in our our shitty food lessons? I could go for some tall bread. <laughs> Yomi has serious practical problems. All theory and no praxis. <laughs> the princess offers no defense, so you offer my final assault. <laughs> You don't have money. <laughs> don't lie. You couldn't afford, like, a piece of bean. Just like yesterday. It's me pouring my Bloody Marys. I give all that I have for that Chinese sea. She's just trying to help, and Yomi's being a total bench. Come on. Let's be a lesson, chat. When somebody's being nice, don't be a dickhole. <laughs> Choking on my own rage here. This is a particularly long story segment. It's a little awkward to sit through the more serious ones. I was kind of hoping for the more of the silly ones. Yomi... Well, I guess we did have the eating contest. Which was already questionable. But y Yomi... Doesn't usually have the funnier ones. Usually that's more Mirai. And... And, um, Hikage. Yomi is not the funny one. Such a rotten person really gives such joy to children. I'm gonna speed up the text a little bit. I'm I'm getting tired of Yomi being an asshole to everyone. <laughs> no fair! You can't. You already had money. You can't have a good heart too. Yeah, Yomi is a little fucked up. 
Like, excusably so, but still. Like, why don't her friends, like, feed her and, like, make her not have brain problems? Like, is it, the ninjas are supposed to not be... I mean, maybe not crazy rich, but they're supposed to have some money. If you're a ninja without money, I feel like you must be really bad. You must either be really bad at being a ninja or with money, or possibly both. You must be like a Bitcoin ninja. Like, yo, I got some fat bean coin. You gotta invest in bean coin. It's the only currency backed with real bean sprouts. That seems like something Yomi would be into. Yo, and this is the part where Yomi attacks somebody because they're nice. Because she's fucking crazy. <laughs> Karuga is so fucking metal, she doesn't even care. She's just like, eh, whatevs. You're a plebe, and you will not scare me. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Sad things are about to happen. You know? <laughs> this is something I've always felt about this series, but I guess it's even more strong than I realized. Um, Shinobi Versus is a good game, but it... It really replays almost the entirety of this game's story. I thought it kind of added the backstories, but I guess it just kind of reframes them and puts them more coherently into one thing. Um, <laughs> I guess because that game kind of had all of the uh, original characters' backstories and stuff, and I didn't realize it was all in Burst as well. Um, <laughs> but that's so weird because Burst is like... 75 to 80 percent of this game is covered in burst and it's weird or in um genovi versus it's just <laughs> you get such a weird experience because like you've seen so much of it and it's like why did they do it like this i think it's partly because like burst was on vita burst was like on playstation for the first time so like they figured people like me would not have played the the original one but I did play a little of the original one, and even I could tell that they were reusing a lot of stuff. It's kind of weird. It's not a problem the other games have really had, but... Hello, Parker. Hi. I see you. Yes. Yes, do you want to say hi to the camera? No? <laughs> okay. I always wanted him to talk for the mic, but he never does. Oh yeah, board game night tomorrow, by the way. She's being edgy. Parker. Parker, calm down. Yes. Is our audio balance all right here? Looks kind of alright. I'm super, I'm super paranoid about audio because we had that one news dash stream. It was terrible, and like only people with terrible ears were watching. No offense, but like, so like an hour in, somebody commented on it, and then I started listening to it, and it was like, oh my god, this is terrible. How did you not notice? And then, in an entirely different way, the the LSD stream that I uploaded to YouTube, for some reason, it was all messed up, and I it's, it's never been like that before. Like that one was just the encoding that screwed it up. I don't I don't know. <laughs> Don't let anyone tell you that making stupid videos for YouTube is easy. It's... <laughs> there's so much that can go wrong. It's crazy. Parker. Parker, calm down. Parker, please. <laughs> Parker, there's drama happening. You're not allowed to interrupt. Oh, 
more loving family. I wonder what that's like. Bag kick dot wave. Well, it's capitalism. I grasp her shoulders and shake her. <laughs> Who's like, what is wrong with this crazy person? Sometimes I wonder what Parker is tasting, because he finds blinds delicious. He likes to lick my blinds, and he likes to lick my, um, controllers. Oh, here we go. She's about to turn GLaDOS on my ass. <laughs> there was this like there was some article about somebody that was like really upset that GLaDOS was like making fun of um, Chell for being adopted and number A we don't even know if Chell is actually adopted or if it's just GLaDOS being a bitch and number two <laughs> GLaDOS is being a bitch that's the whole point of it the whole point is that GLaDOS is being terrible that's that's why I don't know if you knew this spoilers Local gamer discovers that GLaDOS may not be as nice as she appears. The controllers maybe thinks that they're, they're his and he's trying to cleanse them of your sense. Yeah, I don't know. He's like smells the finger greases, I guess. Like specifically the analog sticks usually and sometimes he likes to bite the like handle nubs. I don't know why. He tries to bite plastic things. I feel like we've been watching this cutscene for half an hour. Get, all right, get, go, get going. Just a pride and a prostration, not asking for simple forgiveness at all. Well, they are my enemies. My path is not so easy to change, for I am. Edge Lord. Aww. They're not psychopaths to each other. How nice. This is, def <laughs> this is definitely not how it goes on the um, the Hanzo side of things. Her hands are warm. I've always been under the impression that rich people are literally cold-blooded. That's, uh, it's taking things a bit literally here, buddy. She has a tender warmth. Why oh, does that look like Vert? A little bit. Just a little bit. If the eyes were open, not so much. Art style is really quite different, though. There's a good art style, frick, what is it called? It's like the design bible or something? I, I have it in my room, but like not at a place I can find it. There's a good... <laughs> you look dreadful, princess! Um, <laughs> so I was just like trying to go out with her. Um, but yeah, there's a good art book by the uh, designer of all the, the artists for the, you know, concept art and stuff for the Sankagura girls. It's really good. <laughs> of course, in the actual CG, we both look completely amazing. Laughing, crying, laughing again. <laughs> <laughs> this is not how it went. It's, it's touching and nice, but like, <laughs> it, it kind of bothers me that this does not even remotely mesh to like a more generous interpretation of the events between the two schools. This is like 
This is like gaslighting propaganda level differences. <laughs> this is like the exact opposite thing happens. Life is truly mysterious. <laughs> no, no, it doesn't. Shut up, Yomi. <laughs> Yomi's not really all up there. I blame the bean sprouts. I'm not. I'm not sure if bean sprouts alone have the n nutrients necessary to nurture the human brain. New CG unlocked. Ojo-sama, anata wa hoka no okane mochi to wa chigau yo desu. Arigatou, wakatte kudasatte. Suddenly we're back to our normal clothes. <laughs> they're not- they're, <laughs> As much as I like Senator Girl, they've never been the best at like setting up cutscenes and all that stuff. <laughs> the fucking crazy face. Oh my god, I just realized, guys. I started a stage, like, 20 minutes ago. This- all of this dialogue is the- the- the preview of the stage. Cause trouble around the slums to bring down property values. This was a gameplay mechanic in, um... Uh, what's it called? Um... Um, not Retro City Rampage. What's the new one? Uh, Hawaii Shakedown. <laughs> I like that as soon as as soon as she mentions bringing down property values, the crew was like, "Fuck no! You can't lower my property values, punk!" I got a fucking triple mortgage on this bitch. We're helping each other now. <laughs> this is so... this... It's heartful and everything, but it's so incredibly... Obviously incompatible with the other story. I think they could have done a better job to kind of mesh the, like... Nicer interpretation of the evil shinobi... Along with... <laughs> Along with the actual original events. <laughs> I love the little smile. Oh well, this is a cool new background, I think. Or is this just part of this that I've never noticed? Ooh, box. You gotta open the box. Bean sprouts. You. <laughs> Yumi is basically what if you took a person and you made their sex drive only activate on the concept of bean sprouts. Oh fuck. I lost track of the bean sprouts. This I don't need that camera. There we go, that's what I wanted. I don't like the hit the secret files. I preferred when it was really obvious if you're looking at a secret item. Or if it was just like sushi. Or like a rice ball. I mean a jelly donut! I mean, jelly donuts are extra relevant with freaking um, Pokemon Masters being a thing now. I can finally stream that, by the way. I was tempted to today. But I decided against it. But yeah, Pokemon um, Masters no longer requires a VPN. You still have to get an APK if you don't live in Singapore. I think maybe the... Um, maybe the... Canadian preview started up? I don't know. I just have an APK, so I don't care. Yeah, it's still not out yet worldwide, but it's a little bit easier to play now. All of that build up for a mission that took like one minute. Where did she find the ammo to refill those guns? She's so poor. 
You didn't help at all. That didn't help at all. <laughs> I'm just... I've just lost my clothes, but don't don't worry about that part. どうしたの何かまだ問題があるのですか私たちは悪人と善にいつかは戦う定めですええそうですねだからその時が来るまでは私とお友達になってくださいますか私のような貧乏人ではダメでしょうか。ただし。ただし。お嬢様ではなくて。イカルガと呼んでもらえますか。あら、嫌だ。そうですね。ではこれからよろしくお願いします。イカルガさん。I went back and I got some of the, um... I went back and got all the hidden scrolls are missing. Harmony! It's a freaking butt monkey! It's a literal butt monkey! I hate monkeys. <laughs> I know that we're apes and all of that stuff, but like, regular, regular human monkeys, I don't like them. Especially the Pokémon! Apes make the worst Pokémon, I'm sorry. Oranguru is probably like... Oranguru and Passman are like the most okay ones, and I still don't like them and never used them. And then there's like there's six of the same monkey in Gen 5. I <laughs> I have a vendetta against Gen 5, I'm sorry, but it deserves it. And see this whole crap with the ninja scroll is also like different. They're not supposed to already have it. Oh, yeah, I guess you missed that. I I think we saw that in the last stream, but yeah. Hibari just straight up brought us the scroll in this one. Even though it's not what happened. Oh, auto was not on. Oi, Haruka.今はそんな時か。おい。超秘伝忍法書を取り戻しに半蔵の連中が攻めてくるとは思わないのか。大丈夫、大丈夫。もし半蔵が攻めてきたとしても、私とヒバリでちょちょいのちょいだから。はるか
baffling is what it is. Science still can't explain what's happening with Haruka's bra. Haruka, it's weird because like, it's not like they did that because there is no binding style bra thing. There are outfits where that is the thing, <laughs> but she doesn't use that. She just does this, and I don't, I don't know what's happening. Science can't. Ex you can't explain that. BFF act. It's like she started making a binding and then like cut it into pieces and like taped it to her bra to like pretend. I don't I don't I don't, I don't, I don't think it works like that. Or maybe she just wanted to be a mummy, but like a slutty mummy for like Halloween? I think that's my headcanon. More database updated. Make friends. By the way, is there, is there a word for whatever godforsaken thing is covering um, her crotch here? Like, what what is that, like, butt string that she's got going on? It's like not quite a loincloth. I'm sure it's some traditional Japanese crotch floss. You can only buy it at Homura's Crotch Floss Emporium. It's a terrible G <laughs> Look at Mirai! Look at poor Mirai. Or look at poor Hibari and Mirai over there. It's kind of a G string. It's like a. It's like a traditional G string. Like. <laughs> this is a great scene, actually. Look at Hikage over in the background, just like, guys, you're being too loud. And Rin is like, bitch, please. I mean, Suzune. Sorry. Yomi's like. <laughs> <laughs> Let me... <laughs> I guess this is the best image I can find for this. I guess it wasn't really originally an image, so I don't know why I looked for one. <laughs> Before you say I am stoling this ninja art, let me explain you a thing. The, the, the combat of the face. This looks that looks like WarioWare art almost, with Mirai versus uh, Hibari over there. I'm surprised Mirai and Hibari don't fight more often. They're kind of the childish ones. Oh, Dogen, Dogen's a cunt. <laughs> Haruka is just done with this shit. Nothing can be done. By the way, we're the capitalists of Shinobi, so like, I don't know why Yomi likes us. <laughs> Yomi... It's basically the capitalist Shinobi versus the uh, government Shinobi. As if those are two different things. But, uh... <laughs> It's kind of funny that Yomi is over here talking about poor people, and we're, we're funded, like, entirely by rich people. For some reason, that doesn't matter to her. It only matters if other people have, like, enough money to buy a piece of bread. As I said, very misplaced priorities. Anyway, this is Dogen. He sucks ass. If there's a male character, just assume that they suck. Um... The guy whose name that I forget. I keep wanting to call him Kiryu, but that's the guy from Yakuza. 
<laughs> so, I don't remember his name, but the teacher over on the um, Hanzo side is okay. What is his name? Someone must remember. <laughs> I can't not laugh at the words ninja room. I, w well, I wonder what the original exact wording was in Japanese. If it was just freaking shinobi room or what. Nin I mean, it could just literally be ninja room, I guess. Shinobi's just female ninja, right? Which is weird because, like, ostensibly they have male students. They never appear. But there are male ninjas in this world. I don't know where they come from. They're just kind of there, and they're always bad guys. <laughs> but, ostensibly, we- there are male ninjas here. We're a- we're a gynocracy over here. Actually, oddly, that's not the case, despite there being almost no males in existence. <laughs> the leaders are always dudes, because it's Japan, and yeah. <laughs> of course. What, what else was going to happen except the fact that we had to fight? Suzune looks like she's lost like several cup sizes in the background there, by the way. That is like... small. Sleeping with the enemy. Mariah is like constantly angry at everything. She's angry at life. May I guess I probably would be too in her shoes. By the way, isn't that her eye? Isn't that her? Isn't that supposed to be the eye that's covered? Her right eye? I don't remember. I think that is her covered eye, but I could be wrong. Yomi's face right now cracks me so the fuck up. She looks more like... She looks almost more like, um, Shiki. Somewhere out there, someone just wants to see Titty Ninjas and they're like so mad that I'm watching the story. Ninja room. Haruka, a little where did we find, like, a baby tiger with, like, a giant elephantisis head to make that rug out of? That's, uh, Suzune's voice, by the way. We've barely heard her talk at all. I'm sorry that my desk is creaking. That's just old wood desks. This desk is considerably older than I am, so you'll have to forgive it. Haruka. Let's just fight. We, we all know we're just gonna fight. That's what everything- that's no matter- oh, it's this. Rest in peace. Homura parents. Look at that fancy boy house. This is the per- this- You're the person that- That Yomi should be pissed off at. Look at this. Brick mansion. Fancy gate. <laughs> My parents were human garbage. I feel you, fam. <sighs> I fucking feel you. Okay, I don't feel that part. Yeah, this 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 part specifically may be less so. Torture chamber of clothes. If 
father was never home. He was basically a Pokemon protagonist. Or father, protagonist father. Is that seriously one thing I really like about Pokemon Masters? They, there's not really the, um... Like, people just are normal people. Like, you learn that Wolfric has kids and stuff, and it's not like an absentee father and stuff. Father's a remote for now. Physician, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Homura's dad was basically that doctor that we met in, um... What's it called? Uncle Jim Bob's Adventure. Um, heavy rain! Heavy rain! Yeah. Oh, tax evasion. Good old fashioned tax evasion. <laughs> you can't burn bricks with kerosene! Burn the inside, but I don't think the outside is very fire friendly. Oh, <laughs> well, there we go. Oh shit! <laughs> Suzuna is just like. Sneaking around children who are at high risk of burning their parents' house down, apparently. <laughs> okay. Now go back and burn their fucking house. We've got the fake Eiffel Tower slash Space Needle over here. Yeah, I'm a school teacher. Come on, teachers are great. Well, some teachers, anyway. Never really had too many bad teachers. I had some shitty ones, but... I mean, yeah. Probably. Why not? Are you sure? about that? <laughs> the chain around my heart. What impossible outcome. Becoming a ninja, apparently. So at work we've been we have this enterprise relationship management software and it fucking sucks ass. I've been I've been on and off the phone with their support for a couple weeks. No, probably about a month at this point. Um, trying to fix this issue and they're like, oh no, we can't reproduce it, we can't reproduce it. All you have to do to reproduce it is install the thing, install the latest update, and then run a search. And it happens every time on every single computer I've run it on. But they say they can't reproduce it. They're, they suck. Anyway. I didn't realize we were right in the middle of like huge story bits. I thought we would just be like at the Tiji Ninja Zone, but I don't want to skip the story bits, like... For a lot of people, the story is the main event, and they get really disappointed at the more silly games. I tend to be more for the silly games, personally. Maybe not Peach Ball. Peach Ball is a little bit too silly, but, like, Peach Peach Splash is that perfect zone for me. There's still a little bit of story and some interactions and stuff going on. But it's mostly silly. There's no grim dark crap. People are having fun. All of this. 
Again, this is the pre-fight story. We haven't even gotten to the fight. I feel like these story bits are like three or four times longer than most of the ones we've seen before. I'm gonna leave this up long enough to read, but I'm not gonna leave it much longer than that. Since when did you know about puppet stuff? Oh wait, no, this is- oh, f oh my bad. This is Haruka, shit, my bad. I don't think- hold on. I don't think Haruka's uh, parents' crap is in Shinobi Versus. I guess I did learn something today. My bad. I thought we were- <laughs> When you don't show the character and it's just voices, and I'm not as used to certain characters' voices, Mirai is very easy to tell from voice. Actually, did we hear Haruka's voice? I wouldn't know Haruka's voice. Whatever. My revenge will be sweet. <laughs> Talk about friends. I wonder if Sarah Figura 7 will actually have lip sync. I don't think it's as big a deal as most people, but it is kind of surprising that even for a remake, a remake done in an already finished engine with already finished maps, they didn't kind of try to do with that. Someone on the, the design team, by the way, really likes those knee socks. Those, like, really fluffy straight ones. Or not fluffy, but, like, <laughs> Yes, the power of friendship. What is this accordion music? So how's everyone's week? I had a pretty alright week I guess. Oh, <laughs> it's edgy colors. Music. Dramatic accordion music, huh? I don't think I've heard this track before. Hold on. Oh, shit. <laughs> I've already lost. Okay. Doing frantic, and this was a mistake. I had a pretty alright week, I guess. Tried the new sushi place, was pretty, pretty alright. Expensive, but good. Um, work has been... We pretty much settled in with the new office and not really too many issues. Right, differently. Mediacom has been shitty. But when, when isn't it? It's been particularly bad lately. I should be getting a better deal on Mediacom soon though. Wasn't I supposed to be the one bringing friends? What is- Haruma said that she didn't need- Amora said she didn't need friends. And she's the one bringing friends. This is unfair, this is hacks. Proof is ever my favorite playable character in terms of gameplay. She's one of the slower characters, and she doesn't really feel... It doesn't feel justified in being slow -less. She doesn't... Her attacks aren't punchy like Yomi and uh, Yozakura's are. It's just this dumb robot dicking around. I like the little boat peep sheep's enemies, though. They have, like, this crazy evil murder sheep, like, outer costume. Then, of course, on the inside is a bikini because, you know, it's a girl. 
Of gameplay in general on the uh, Hedge Bow side. I like, um, I like new Hedge Bow. Uh, Mirai's okay. Mirai and uh, Hamura. Hamura's pretty simple gameplay wise. She's. Oh, like Asuka. Why not? This court went super quiet. It's always when I start to stream, things go quiet, though. There was somebody that joined the Discord only to post some, like, shitty Minecraft meme. What is with cringe Minecraft players? Like, I'm not even one to, like, usually, like, huh, Minecraft cringe. But, like, there's a huge, like, resurgence of shitty loser Minecraft players, like, be like, wow, Minecraft is life! And, like, what the fuck? Everyone hated Minecraft just like a year ago. Everyone was like, wow, Minecraft is total cringe. And now it's like, like what, what happened? Now, like, Reddit is completely consumed by this Fortnite bad Minecraft good meme, if you can even call it a meme. Like, Minecraft has not substantively changed in like eight years. What happened? Why are people being weird now? And I say this to somebody that loved Minecraft, like, I've got like 30 or so Minecraft videos on YouTube. But like all of a sudden it's everywhere. And it's like, what? And it better not be because of a certain fedora wearing douchebag. Because that's just not open. Oh, hold up. I gotta check for things. I think this one has two. What was that? Oh, secret growth medicine. There was like a bunch of multicolored cabbages, and I was like, what? Wasn't there two? Huh. I thought there was two for this match. Why would you think there's like no damage? Wow. No hate to people that just like, like Minecraft and just enjoy it as a game. But, like, people that just, like, want to post shitty memes, like, no. Don't do that. It doesn't really matter what game you're posting shitty memes about, either. Just don't do that. There's a few people we've had to ban in Discord. Some of our first bans in, like, a year, by the way. They just, like, come in and post, like, Minecraft gang. Who up? Hit that mine button. It's like, what? How did you even find this server? What is who, who let you stay up past 5 p.m.? I don't understand. Yeah, she did it. She did the thing. I don't like the transformation animations in this one as much. I like the Estival ones better. See, look at, look, at, look at how much more damage. That does like 5 to 10 more damage times more damage than the uh, level 1 super. Why is the level 1 super even a thing? I guess crowd control, quote unquote, but that's not usually a big deal in this game. <laughs> so weak, look at that, it did like nothing. It did less than my normal attack. Why is it so bad? That's ridiculous. Angry. If 
freaking parking noise it makes. まだだ。まだ私は戦えるぞ。え、ちょ、ちょ、ちょっと待って。ホムラちゃん、どれだけタフなのよ。恋はるか。決着はどちらかが動けなくなるまでだ。もういい、もういいわ。ホムラちゃ
Karuka badge. Soul bracelet. I'm out of money. Alright. Why is my stream so stable now? It's been so shit every time I've like tried to do things. You get out of here, Yumi. Nobody likes you. Twitch used to ban you for being in this room, by the way. Hell, maybe they still do, but Twitch isn't always will be ridiculous. Don't 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 confuse me being streaming on Twitch again for actually liking Twitch. They're a weird ass company and were even before the whole Amazon acquisition. Acquisition. Right. Let's put some people in some things. Let's see what we got. None of these. See, that's, that's how you use a binding, Haruma. This is how you use a b I mean, not really, because it's like impossibly loose. But like. Sure, we can put that on you, sure. Wait, maybe better colors, though. Can we change colors again? Oh, here we go. <laughs> Guys, it's the same color! Oh, 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 you gotta press X, never mind. What is this purple bubble tape? I can't, guys, I can't find purple bubble tape, and this makes me hungry. For various reasons, but no, they're like... They don't have purple bubble tape! I only like purple bubble tape! Um, like, the pink bubble tape is okay, but it's just like regular gum flavored. I, w I loved, as a kid, the purple bubble tape, and you can't get it anymore! At least not at the one grocery store I bothered to actually look at it. I'm gonna look on Amazon right now. Amazon purple bubble tape. I think it was grape. Like, artificial bubble... flavored colors. No, it doesn't have it! You fucks! There's a blue one! What is this? Sour blue raspberry, that actually sounds kinda good. But this is not... This is not my bubble tape. This is not my beautiful bubble tape! Can you even read that chat on the screen, by the way? That freaking. I tried to add, like, an outline to chat. Let's put it over there. I tried to add an outline, and it just looks really shitty. I had this thing for YouTube that was, like, really good, and it doesn't work for Twitch. What is this? This orange tape. What is this? I like that her bindings just reminded me of bubble tape, and now I'm just talking about bubble tape. But I can't find the grape bubble tape! I found one, but it's fifty dollars for tw excuse me for twelve counts, and I have I have no idea what the market price for bubble tape is these days. Now I have hiccups. There's one, f there's one for twelve. <laughs> Twenty dollars for twelve. That sounds more reasonable. Hiccups are suddenly bad. Like, real bad. Meanwhile, Trihex gets a 24 hour ban for streaming the Democratic debate. Yeah, wasn't CNN super vicious about that? CNN fucking sucks, by the way. Not for the reason anyone on the right will tell you CNN sucks, but like, they really are centrist news network, and they were running like pharmaceutical ads. Oops, oops, oops. I just, I just almost deleted completely the wrong parts of the stream. Um, damn it, Hermora, make me hungry for bubble tape. And this is like pink bubble tape! I kinda like these colors though. Um, yeah, there were, did you not, like, the US is like the only major, like, Western 
country that allows, like, advertisements for pharmaceuticals. Like, your doctor is supposed to tell you what medicine you need. You're not supposed to be like, hey, I heard that you're supposed to give me Boostamaxel, the edgiest fucking heart medicine ever. Like, what does your fucking doctor care what fucking ad you saw on TV? It's dumb as hell. MSNBC is the only news channel with balls. They really are. Oh, this this is like exactly for Hermora. This is perfect. I'll just leave that. Um, I usually leave the uh, transformation outfits. Um, yeah, MSNBC has learned and like changed things for the better. Yeah, 45. Like the the thing with oh, you can change. <laughs> This is- I like this button. This is a good button. You can just do this. Best button. Um... But yeah, MSNBC has learned that you cannot just show, like, a fascist lying propagandist and, like, unfiltered live. They're somehow the only news channel that hasn't learned that. By the way, didn't, um... Didn't Sekigura 2 on 3DS have like a feature where you could actually adjust cup size? I think it was like a DLC. But you could make Mirai not flat for like the first time ever. Uh, that's what we got for you. What? <laughs> so, so, many, so many of the outfits have like little texture details. Like the bursting at the seams kind of thing here. That Hibari's thing has got going on. And they look, they look so ridiculous. <laughs> they look ridiculous on Mirai. Like, look at that. It cracks me up. You crack me up, little buddy. They used to be really bad. In Shinobi Versus, it actually looked pretty bad. It still looks kind of... You can see the titty outlines on the on the textures. And, and there's no titty to be had here. But, um... It looks a bit better than it used to. World's smallest Yukata. Look at this fucking power stance. <laughs> She's gonna be your boss. I think that's what I gave her in, um, um, Who's he wants it land in um, Peach Peach Splash? It just cracks me up. It's supposed to be like bursting at the seams, but it's it's not. <laughs> oh no, Mr. Whale! Mr. Whale is now so tiny. I think this shirt just says, like, Opai or something. I can't read. Space runes, though. What is this? <laughs> oh, they're fake hundred dollar bills. Incredible. <laughs> Survival sh She looks like fucking... Off... Like... Off-duty... Snake Pliskin. Colonel. I'm flat as shit. All the other girls are so dummy thick. What do I do, Colonel? A girl has feelings, Colonel. <laughs> Basically, Tifa's outfit. Again, looks really weird on Mirai. <laughs> most, most things. <laughs> This one in particular, like, what is happening? <laughs> Mirai doesn't look right in, like, anything. <laughs> no. No, no, no. Um... What actually looks somewhat reasonable, I think. Stop- stop making those noises with your mouth, please. I, I can't deal with her noises. Alright, we're gonna deal with that, that's fine. Oh wait, let's look at the colors, though. I was ready to check the colors. 
The black is probably fine though. No, black Black works. Oh wait, hold on though. I think we can improve this situation. Aw oh, shit. Oh, I don't have it. Soon though. <laughs> you can get a little Mirai badge. Let's put that. How do I. Shit, how do we do that? You can, this <laughs> you can tell it's kind of assumed to be on a different size of person here. Um. Not quite that far. There we go. And it kind of tilts it. No, no. There we go. Kind of. Oh. <laughs> now you know I don't usually mess with this on stream. That's that's fine. That'll do fine. It's very fiddly. Put everybody in something different for difference for differences sake. I mean this is the obvious. Eh, why not? Sure. I I talked I was on <laughs> When you switch back into these ones, the ribbon bounces. Um I was on the phone for like half an hour with Mediacom, like, it was supposed to be just a simple, hey, give me your newest offer thing. Uh, by the way, if you didn't know, like, if you're on, if you're on a quote-unquote no contract deal, usually you're supposed to call your internet company every couple of months, or a couple, couple of months, every year or two, and like, negotiate a new deal. Arr, I be a booty pirate. Um, but, um... Eh, why not? And, um, you know, renegotiate your deal. And so I did that, and I'm gonna get a gigabit down, and... What was it? Like, a hundred? It was like 50 up? It was like, not incredible up. But better than I have. So, hopefully I get that. But I never get the up that I ask for. Speaking of, hello Mediacom Malady. Is this how we're gonna be, Mediacom? Is this how we're gonna be today? All right, let's cut down the bit rates. Mediacom, please. Mediacom, please. Me be a com. Let me, let me stream titty. Please. I'm begging you, Mediacom. Just fuck. <laughs> I, I don't. I don't think it's gonna let me stream. Are we back? Okay. They have something against snack. They're racist against snack. <laughs> I kind of like Katsuragi's outfit on it. You got that in green? Not really. Oh, never mind! Eh, sure, why not? They have this anti-snack bias. Still the best button. All right, hopefully, oh, it's still bad. Come on, 
Come on, Mediacom. We'll try one more mission, and if Mediacom is not straightened out, I'll probably quit here. We <laughs> only got through three missions. Four missions. Before Mediacom crapped out, but I'm not too surprised. Unfortunately, with Board Game Night, I can stream at pretty low bitrate for Board Game Night, because it's just Mario Party. Fuck, I need to make sure I can do that, by the way. I'm gonna have to do that right after the stream. I gotta test and make sure that, um... I think I'm just gonna stream it in Dolphin. Um, just because... Uh, it'll look better if Medicom isn't doing this. <laughs> this is the face of intense challenge. This is the face that you make when your life is on the line. This is the face that I make when the, my life is on the line, anyway. I don't know what kind of face y'all make. That's good old Hikage. Ah, uh, Medicom. Are we cool? Are we alright? <laughs> Let me see. Nope. It's still shit. Alright. We'll finish this one mission. And that'll be it. Medicom is very angry. This is when the Sakaga is in the squad. Snack squad goals. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know what I did to offend the Mediacom beast. But Mediacom is very unhappy with me lately. <laughs> I forgot about that. If you're in an unterrible costume and you'd go frantic, you're just wearing the same thing. It's why I don't usually use the swimsuits. It's kind of, it kind of sucks. I would be fine if there was just an under swimsuit, mysteriously. That does not make sense. It's just like. You can't take away the strip mechanic, like, come on. It's it's part of the series, come on. But what else? A slightly silly decision. I can kinda see why they did it. Because they can't show the nipulars and other such regions. Which is kinda funny. Japanese or er, um a lot of people think that in Japan, oh, anything goes in Japan. You can do all kinds of stuff that you can't do in the West. Nope! Um, Japanese censorship laws are drastically stricter than Western. Um, you can have a nipular. You can have a nipular on the, um, the good old fashioned uh, Kratos kills the world, the video game, uh, God of War situation. But you can't have those! All nipples are illegal. If you have a nipple, you're not legally allowed to be in Japan. You gotta sand that shit off with a belt sander, I'm sorry. It's gonna be bad. <laughs> this edgy color scheme. They love- they were so proud of this. <laughs> it's very rarely necessary. Or even appropriate. But, um, they were really proud of it. I think Estival versus the, the uh, transformation sequence is better. I guess they're trying to keep it simple? I don't know. Doink! Okay, level up. Level ups are super unfair in this game, by the way. As, as you can see, it fully refills your thing, it fully heals you. If you can get a level up, it'll win you a level that you should have lost by any means. Thank you, extend your skill, please. 
All right, yeah, Mediacom is super angry that I have dared to stream today. So we're gonna cut it. We're gonna cut it as I finish up here. It'll look better on YouTube. Y'all on YouTube, you should be glad. This looked really I bad on Twitch, but I fixed it with space magic. Ninja titty magic, just for you. Just for you. We were holding back because we were friends. We, we get it. We get that we're friends. <laughs> the game does kind of beat your head over, over your head. It beats your head, it rips your head out, and it beats you over the head with your own head. With some of the uh, more major themes of the series. Good guy Hikage. Good guy Snack throws the match. Why do you get to have clothes? My clothes are ruined. Wait a minute, I just I transformed. You were supposed to be in a thing. Alright, that's a thing. Um I wonder if you disabled. There's a thing where it like it looks like she's growing. Um, there's a thing where you can like not show costume changes in the cutscenes. I wonder if that includes the nudity because the nudity is not in the cutscenes, and I don't know if that was a Sony thing or if that's a like drama enhancy thing or if that's just the way it works. But usually, if you stripped an opponent nude. It um, it showed in the thinger. The after fight thing. Level up and saved my life multiple times, SK. Yeah, it's really it really does help. <laughs> Thank you so much to anyone who has managed to continue watching despite the media com malady. Let me kick the bit right way down so I can talk for just a sec here. All right. Sorry that Mediacom has like completely destroyed the day after I thought it would be fine. Um, I really wanted to get to Mirai to see what she's being all dramatic about. I guess we're all being dramatic. I guess we're all fighting and stuff. But I, this bit rate that I'm currently dealing with is kind of too assified to stream with. So for tonight, I'm gonna call it quits. This was still fun. We're gonna finish... <laughs> we'll eventually probably finish this game. We just got like a chapter and a half. A couple chapters between the two schools to go through. But, um... Yeah, Mediacom does not want to happen today. I've got Mediacom text coming Wednesday. And hopefully we'll be fine to stream board game night tomorrow. Worst case with board game night... I'll stream it just really low resolution, and or low um, bitrate, and I mean, it's Mario Party, it doesn't matter. We're playing an all CPU drinking game, so um, come join that. Again, anybody that wants to join can join. All you gotta do to be part of board game night, either support me on Patreon, be a YouTube member, or sub on Twitch. Just any kind of paid support you can get in for any, any amount, even just a buck a month. So, um, join on up, and you can get, get in the thing. Sunday, God, I hope Mediacom does not screw us up. We're gonna stream Borderlands Game of the Year Enhanced. And with that one, if I have to, I'll just record locally, and I'll just upload on YouTube. <laughs> but, um, yeah. I hate, I hate that Mediacom keeps ruining Center Kagura for us. It really is a good game, but Mediacom does not want you to know. Mediacom wants to keep the secrets for itself. <laughs> good night, everyone. My, my tolerance for Mediacom bullcrap has reached its end. Hope you all have a good weekend. See you tomorrow for board game night. Tap tap here. If you like the video, make sure to subscribe and leave a like if you want. I read every comment posted, so don't embarrass yourself. Social media links in the description, including my Patreon and any relevant links to the game.